Luke Classic, but what was the difference in the end, do you think? Uh, I just missed my last shot. <laughs> I thought both teams played well. I, was, I thought it was, a, it was a great game. It was fun to be out there. Well, Even though the score was tight, all the was there ever a sense that you were sort of, she was chasing you for much of that game? No, it just felt like a great game back and forth, and that's, you know, what you want. It was, uh, yeah, it was, a, it was a good game, fun to play, and uh, hopefully we'll come up and play like that tomorrow. That draw that Rachel made to force the extra end, just what was going through your, your mind? Was yeah, I mean, it was a very hard draw. She had to, she made it perfect, and um, yeah, I, th I thought she was going to rub on the front a little bit more, and she just kind of just feathered it and made it perfect. Did you guys feel like you had to play perfect tonight to, to beat these guys? I mean, they've had such a great year and number one team and everything. And I just just have to play, just have to take advantage of your opportunities just like any other team. And we know we had a couple opportunities we let slip through our, our grasp, but I thought for the most part we did that tonight. If you get a rematch against this team in the final, what do you think that would be like? Fun. Yeah. 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 yeah, we just want to play in the final. Down yeah. the tent then we'll have to walk again. Hopefully. That would be great for everybody involved, wouldn't it? Yeah. You know, last year you guys got to skip ahead to the final. Is there is there any value in you know having to play that semifinal? I, the day, I've said kind of for 20 years that if if you know you're going to win the semifinal, it's always good to play in it. So hopefully we'll come out and win tomorrow. Well, it must have been another fun night out there with you and Jennifer Jones. Yeah, unbelievable game. They played unbelievable. Um, yeah, they had us in a pile of trouble every end, and uh, we stuck stuck with it. And unbelievable sweep um, by my supers to get that to the pin. To, to continue the game and um, yeah, just the right side of the inch today. You only threw one draw through nine ends and that you had to make that perfect draw. What's I know. Going through your mind? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I knew uh, in in ten that uh, we, we talked about it. I hadn't thrown a draw all game. Um, I think I threw one to the T line and uh, it's uh, it's on my supers to they're they're just phenomenal at, at seeing lines and communicating the weight to me. Um, and uh, yeah, they did a phenomenal job getting into the pin there. So how important is it to get to avoid the semi battle? Uh, it's just unbelievable. My team battled so hard out there, trying. We we missed runs by millimeters. Like it was it was, it was a battle. Um, they played phenomenal, and uh, kudos to them. I'm, that, that was an unbelievable game by them. I'm sure we'll both teams are going to come out firing tomorrow morning and. Um, just uh, huge for us to be able to make another final. So proud of my team for staying, staying tough and staying together and, and believing right to the end. Yeah. Rachel, I mean, that was a non-elimination game, but the re reaction of your team after that game kind of said it all. I heard you scream. That was unreal. I mean, what did winning that game mean to you? Um, it's just an unbelievable feeling to be able to to beat Jen at her absolute best. Like that was a that was a huge game, a battle back and forth that had everything. Um, they played phenomenal, and uh, my team made it a pile of shots, and honestly, just millimeters here and there, and uh, uh, yeah, it was just a, a very emotional game. Like, had to had to draw to the pin just to continue the game, and um, trying to figure out where to go, and yeah, we got a miss out of out of Jen and, and the extra. What was going through your mind in the tenth end before Rachel had to make that draw? Oh, I was just uh, thinking about what the speed would be and how I could sweep it, and how to communicate that to Rachel and help her make the shot. Confident she'd do it? Oh yeah. You know she only had like one draw through absolutely, nine minutes? Absolutely, absolutely. It's Rachel Holman. <laughs> that's that's got to be a great feeling. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. It's like being a part of a game like that. That was a chess match from the first time to the 11th. Yeah, it was thrilling. Like I'm, I'm still shaking. <laughs> um, but it was, we knew we were going to have to bring our best game today to compete with Jen. Her team's amazing, we know that. And um, yeah, it was a thrilling game. Rachel's draw, how she made to force extra end. I suppose going through your head so I hit the bottom there. Oh, I was so happy. <laughs> so happy, especially because her first one, I thought she threw good enough to make it, and it just, the line just didn't quite get there. So knowing that we knew what the speed was, and she threw it great out of her hand, and I just knew I just had to judge it as the outside sweeper and help Emma sweep it. Um, yeah, it was amazing. This was a non elimination game, but listening to the skips' voices, the urgency out there, it did not feel like one. And after the game, the big reaction from your team, I heard Rachel scream, that was unreal. Like, can you just describe that feeling and, and what it means to you to win a game that like no one was going to be eliminated? Yeah, you know? yeah. Every, every team here is so good, right? So any chance you have to get to the final without having to play another amazing team, um, it's weight off your back, right? I mean, if you know you can go and play that next game and win it, 
it's nice to get the games in, but every team that's every team here is so good, and you know you have to bring your A game every single time. So to not have to play <laughs> one more amazing team, to know that we're in the final is is huge.